Alrighty, folks. Welcome on back to Lego City Undercover. Uh, I'm currently loading into the mission that we left off on last time. Uh, so we will get a little bit of a cutscene again. Kind of as a reminder. Sheesh, that is one small step, Foreman. Perfect. While they're all busy working on the shuttle, I can just get to the moon buggy, which is somewhere around there. Uh, in the middle of the shuttle. Ellie, Chen wants me to take a moon buggy. Wow. Yeah, but I can't get to it because it's in the shuttle surrounded by mechanics, and I'm in the control room. Maybe you can do something to get their attention. That's the last thing I want, isn't it? No, because then they'll have to come to the control room, meaning you can sneak into the hangar. Okay, I'll just try pressing some buttons then. What's the worst that can happen? <laughs> I love his what's the worst that can happen. So I guess flying a rocket is basically the same as being in a rodeo. I do, I do love some of the, the puns that they put in Lego games anymore. Really? Around in a circle? I wish it played the sounds when I did it. Huh. All right. Well, I do know that we need studs. And I believe building stuff is supposed to give me studs. I didn't know it was going to give me that little. Prepping the space rocket for engine test. Confirming safety measures. And yes, handbrake is applied. Really? They called it a handbrake? <laughs> All right, so let's see here. What's new for me? Um, this is the first episode that I'm recording today. So it's, those are usually the ones where I give the updates, which ironically I should probably start um, actually recording them in the order that they go up for the week instead of just recording whatever I feel like first and always recording XCOM last. Um I think part of the reason that I record XCOM last is because I know that I'll enjoy it um, more, quote unquote. Calculating optimal rocket flight path. Flight path calculated as upwards. I think that's why I do that. Sweet. Oh, and that was a uh, shield piece. Perfect. Okay. Oh, right. Teleporter. I'm sitting here going, okay, so where are we supposed to go? <laughs> Having your atoms scrambled by a teleport kind of tickles. Wouldn't know. Never had it happen. That I know of. All right. Let's see here. Apparently, I have to build something. Or a lot of some things. Huh. Okay. <laughs> I can confirm that we are pine fresh. I repeat, pine fresh. Yeah, these sayings are going to get kind of funny, but they're also kind of annoying. Or I should say, they are funny, but they're going to get annoying. There we go. Now I can get back up here anytime I want to. Well, without using the teleporter. 
Alright, so we got down. Oh, sorry. Really? It wouldn't let me change it the second time. Right, so what do we get this time? Yeah, color gun. Oh, I forgot to turn on all of our uh, extras. Well, our our couple extras, those two. I'm sitting here going, "Wow, this is taking a whole lot longer to." Uh, it looks like this track's got a hole in it. To get the studs that we need. All right, so this should be the last painting, which should be another. Yeah. Aha. Nice. All right. I got to remember to keep Sheesh. our eyes Glad out. My watch doesn't take a battery this size. <laughs> Got to remember to keep my eyes out for the red brick. Oh. I was wondering when we were going to get to use dynamite. Hi, boys. There we go. Let's see what's in this crate. Now checking in flight snacking reserves. Pretzel levels are looking a bit low, but chocolate and candy levels are good. <laughs> what? Soda levels at optimum with five different flavors, including two diet sodas. <laughs> okay, that one was actually pretty good. I, I have to admit, that one was that one was pretty good. Oh, that's going to be the, uh, yeah. Ah, fine. Yeah, destroy the, the drink machine. And some speakers. You know, we haven't had a build, um... A thing that we need to build just yet. Testing shuttle radio receiver. This is crazy day. Coming to you with non-stop hits for the next six weeks. Radio receiver tested A-OK. <laughs> okay, so we can't do that yet. So let's do these then real quick. Get some more studs. So I was just holding B on that one. Whoa. I didn't know we could destroy the consoles. Hmm. Okay. Oops. Forgot to do that. Oh, well. So the... Oh, please don't tell me you're going to actually Rocket say all the way to 100. <laughs> I don't suppose anyone has a full gas can in the car. All right. So anyone? Okay, someone's going to have to go to the gas station to get more fuel. This is embarrassing. 
So I usually those computers wasn't the answer. Turn Steam off. Um, like the at least the like my friends are online portion. Um, because oh, okay, now it makes more sense. Um, because I I don't like giving out people's like Steam names. Um, mine is part of my YouTube channel, and you guys know that because it's on my, uh, what do you call it? You guys can get to part of it. At least you can see my games. So, let's see here. What are we doing up here? Oh, that's an interesting way to get around. Kind of like it. Yay, for malfunctioning parts. Yep, that might get their attention. I hope that vent up there leads to the hangar. Oh, power levels have dropped off the scale. All engineering staff return to the control room and check systems. <laughs> They're not going to have any systems to check. I kind of accidentally um destroyed all the computers. Ooh. I wonder if my driving license covers space rockets. I hope so, because that's going to be fun to fly. Ellie, how do I get the moon buggy out of the shuttle? There should be a button you can press to open its delivery bay. And that'd need power to work, right? Yeah. Why? I think I broke the power supply back there. And now the control room is full of people. Right. Hang on. It's okay. There should be some high-powered lasers in the hangar. You can use them to power up the shuttle. Wow. There is literally nothing you can't find with these online encyclopedias. Okay. Anything else I should know? The annual rainfall in Lego City? Thanks, Ellie. Uh, let's see here. Can I turn you green? No, that doesn't do anything. So I need to get another different color. So we got this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Haha! -ha! Color swapper. Okay. So we need to hit. No, not you. Well, that's fine. Oh. I didn't need to hit that other one. Well, this is going to be fun, isn't it? Yeah, this should be interesting. I do like how the laser turns off. Ow. There we go. I don't like how you can't arrest the last one. I don't know. Maybe that's just a personal thing for me. Too used to actually being able to defeat enemies. Uh, we need more dynamite for that. That probably needs power. This is something we're going to have to move somewhere. Not that particular direction there. All right. Yeah, for stuff. I love stuff. <laughs> All right. I'll do you in just a second. Can't do that. One out of five. Oh, man. You mean I have to go find five of those funky looking things? Oh, hey, look, studs. Oh, good. The laser doesn't hurt me.
All right. Uh, there's two. Oops. I don't think you're going to do anything. So I'm going to change the color, and that comes all the way over here. Which looks like it needs something put on it. Well, here's another color changer. wonder what color it gives me. Red. Which means there's a green switch somewhere that I have to flip. Okay. So that let that laser go. Let's see if I can find these other two or three, I guess. Um, what you call them? Space plane buggy things. Okay, so we don't know where those go yet. So let's swap out. Green to red. Oh yeah, that was probably a great idea. Let's drop the rocket engine on the ground. Alright, so now I need silver again. There we go. Oh, ho! Okay, I get how this is supposed to work. I get it now. Laser two connected. Perfect. All right, give me the studs. We're now going to do these. Because I think one of them is going to give me dynamite. Whoop. There we go. Does this one give me the dynamite? This one gives me... No. Just a uh, thing to build and change the color of. Laser one connected. Limited shuttle systems activated. There we go. <laughs> Great. There we go. Hi, boys. Welcome to the party. Okay, that one wasn't bad. That was nice and short. Let's see here. Can I open this? No, it does not look like it. Didn't I get a second crate with which to open stuff? One of these? I guess I didn't. Okay. Time to go back upstairs. Whoa! <laughs> that was a little bit too close. Actually, that was that was really too close. I don't know how I feel about... Oh, hey, look. Number three. Um, I feel about every long-distance jump like that being in slow motion. I don't know how I feel about that. Whoop. B. Okay. I don't think I've done one of those on the uh, with the... Uh, controller yet.
Dang. I was hoping there was something more. That's okay. Yeah, I had a feeling that was coming over. Alright. Where does it put the buggy? Oh, it just drops it. Perfect. That's, that's, that's great. Oh, I need the buggy for it. There we go. Hey, that's my car. It's not your car. You are so possessive. Fine, it's our car, but it isn't his. Come on. <laughs> Let's return and set the coffee down nicely. Men better be waiting for me at the dock. Awesome. That was actually fun. I only got two. But that's okay. We'll have to go back and get the rest of them later. I did get 100% for City Hero. And that's me a gold brick. I still can't believe there's 450 gold bricks that I have to get. That That's a bit ridiculous. Just a wee bit. Driver, bad news. My men aren't waiting for you at the dock. Yeah, I can see that. They're running late. And by running late, I mean... Still sat here on their behinds! Oh, they've actually gone. Uh, who am I going to shout at now? They'll be here soon, right? I guess so. Just don't let the moon buggy get damaged until they get there. Oh, hmm. I'm going out to the street so I can yell at some strangers. See you, driver. I thought I was going to have to run back to the buggy. Okay. So, I have to avoid security for a full minute. This should be fairly easy. I mean, I'm already, like, way ahead of them. Ah! Alright, so security will attempt to destroy the buggy. Avoid them and wait for Chan's men. What was that? Why is it ticking at me? What does it mean? <laughs> Alright. So let's go back this way. Oh, I got two of them on me. It means I passed it, right? Yeah. Alright. Well, let's go back down to the dock. And return their buggy. Anybody remember how to zoom out? Oh, nope, that's horn. Oh, that was, that was almost close. Almost went right into the water. About time, guys. We'll take it from here. Don't follow us. Oh, that's, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Or exactly what it's going to tell me to do. Chapter 8. The Rescue. 
Oh, hey, look, I got an achievement. I couldn't see it. Uh, fine, we'll answer the call. McCain, are you anywhere near downtown? Uh, sure, Chief. Why? We got reports that a gang is trying to abduct Forrest Blackwell. They've got him on top of a building near the downtown science museum. I'm on my way, Chief. Has backup been dispatched? Yes, but by the time they get there, it'll be too late. So hurry up! I really don't want to get on the wrong side of Forrest Blackwell. Wait, I actually got an alien? What is this nonsense? Of course, I had the opportunity to do it, and I didn't. Whoa. No fair switching directions there, buddy. There we go. Aliens caught. Oh, there's 17 of them? Great. And each one is another gold brick. McCain, are you anywhere near downtown? Uh, sure, Chief. Why? We got reports that a gang is trying to abduct Forrest Blackwell. They've got him on top of a building near the downtown science museum. I'm on my way, Chief. Has backup been dispatched? Yes, but by the time they get there, it'll be too late. So hurry up! I really don't want to get on the wrong side of Forrest Blackwell. See, it was done anyway. It just never updated. And I wanted to wait before I did that because, well... I didn't want to listen to uh, Chief again. Alright, so what car did we unlock this time? We have no new ones. Oh, I can't just switch categories. That's kind of annoying. Here we go. We got a bristler. Okay. I don't know what a bristler is. And a Gotland. What else we got? Ooh. The Wrath. Let's take the Wrath in black. Oh, that thing looks gorgeous. Vroom vroom. Oh, yeah. Nice vroom vroom. A little bit hard to control, though. <laughs> Get out of my way. <laughs> Everybody's in my way. All right. Well, I am going to leave the episode off here. Um, we are currently working on making it to downtown. So uh, at the beginning of next episode, I will meet you guys downtown. And we will figure out uh, what is going on with Forrest Blackwell. So until then, uh, if you guys liked the episode, hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I will catch you folks in the next episode. Stay frosty out there.